My name's Kim Wallace, I run Kim Wallace Ceramics. We hand make tableware and giftware here in our Noosa studio on the Sunshine Coast. So I started Kim Wallace Ceramics about 15 years ago. I was a graphic designer by trade. Really wanted to dabble again in crafts that were using my hands more. Tried ceramics and that kind of took off. Started in the corner of my townhouse garage. And now here we are, big building and eight team members and five kilns later. The fact that all these hands have created the piece and not a machine. For me, I love cooking. I'm by no means a chef. I love good produce. I love supporting good producers, local producers. And I feel that then needs to be completed by plating it up on something that has those same values, you know, that was created by hand with a lot of passion and love. You know, it's made from the earth. You can see the brush strokes. You can see the fact that it was made by hand and brushed by hand and the passion that comes with it. So yeah, it just completes the circle for me. So all the clays we use are Australian clays. We use two types. There's an Australian porcelain, which is our white clay, and then we have an Australian stoneware clay, which is slightly natural looking clay and it's got a bit of a fleck in it. So I'm very much a natural kind of organic. I like very understated and muted colours, particularly when it comes to the plate, I like it to be quite natural so that the food really pops something that doesn't date easily either. So again, it's like when you're styling furniture and you just add that pop of colour with a cushion, that's easily updated. So that's kind of how I go about creating my palettes. And yeah, we definitely draw a lot of inspiration from the local surroundings. We have our hinterland cups, which kind of references the mountains, just these layered glazes that work together in the kiln and they create these beautiful effects and it just really reminds us of the mountains in the hinterland here. I keep my application really simple for the core collection in particular because it just lets the food pop and it doesn't distract from it too much. The biggest challenge would be wanting to keep everything in-house and made in Australia and the costs that are associated with that, but I wouldn't want that any other way. Educating customers why they're paying a little bit more to buy Australian made to provide that beautiful handmade canvas. But to see that enthusiasm in the customers that buy the pieces, that's really exciting.